What is up, everybody? This is Zach Hample, and I am here at SunTrust Park in Atlanta for the very first official regular season game. I am super excited. I've been to 52 Major League stadiums prior to this, and I've snagged at least one baseball at all of them. So number 53 today, gotta keep the streak going. It's also gonna be the first time that I've ever been to three different stadiums of just one team. The very last day of the 1992 season, I made it to a game at Fulton County Stadium. It rained, there was no BP, got one baseball. Over the years, I went to 18 games at Turner Field and averaged more than 13 balls per game. That place was amazing. I think SunTrust is gonna be much more difficult from a ball hawking perspective, but it looks like a beautiful facility. Gates are opening three hours early for this opening weekend, so I'll probably get in even before batting practice starts. It's gonna be really crowded, total zoo, but I'm ready for it. There should be some opportunities to catch balls. It's still really early in the day right now, so just gonna wander around a bit, check it out, and then head on inside and show you as much as I possibly can. Yeah, that's what I'm Watch in-game highlights. Well, this is pretty cool over here by the Chop House Gate. Of course, this whole area is brand new. There's restaurants, stores, a concert venue. This isn't real grass that I'm on right now. It's uh, sort of like a little AstroTurf thing, but still, really cool. Nice job by the Braves. This place looks slick. I'm excited for it. I think it's going to be a great place. Do you think you'll come back to Central for a little bit more? Well, I'll be here tomorrow for sure. And I already have a date picked out in May, and I'll probably get here, you know, 10 or 20 or 30 times over the next five or 10 years for sure. Perfect. Now, ball guy, where's Saturdays for? For the boys. Viva. Dude, that's <laughs> awesome, man. The gates are about to open. Fans are cheering. This is the big moment. And experience is at Sun Cross Park. Tickets can be picked up or purchased at the ticket windows located across from the Coca Cola Batting practice is just getting underway. I can see already that the left field seats are filling up. I think that's going to be the hot spot in this stadium. I'm figuring out everything on the fly. I could have done more research. I could have watched the exhibition games on TV. There were some YouTube videos up once the stadium opened. But I kind of like figuring everything out. I, I like it when things are a mystery and a challenge because I know every other stadium so well that to actually walk into a place for the first time is really cool for me. All right, there's three lefties in this group. I want to head over to right field. There it is. My very first ball ever at SunTrust Park. My man, Ian Kroll, tossed it up. Went over my head, ricocheted back perfectly right to me. So that's a good sign. Luck is on my side here in Atlanta. My buddy, fellow ball hawk, David Welch right there. Nice jumping catch. Go, drop, go, drop! All right, second ball of the day. Was that Nick Markakis? I wasn't sure. Hit the back wall, ricocheted down into the last row, and I grabbed it. It's insane out here, man. I'm back in left field now, left center for the moment. I think the cluster of left-handed power hitters is done. So I'm gonna try out this area. I'd love to catch a ball in several different spots and just really get a feel for the stadium. I mean, I'm starting to pick some things up, but this is just still a huge mystery to me at this point. What's going on? Watch all your videos, man. I appreciate it. actually been a little bit slow since that one group that was bombing him out to right field. So it's nice that I had a few glove trick opportunities here. I got two baseballs that way, so four total. But I really want to try to catch a home run on the fly. What's that? Hey, Does it have today's date on the balls? Not sure. I haven't seen it. 
I got my Padres hat right here. Looks a little funky. This was actually a BP hat from a few years ago. And if you can see, number 21 on the inside, this hat belonged to Heath Bell, good buddy of mine, so that's why I wear this one. I think I'm giving up on left field for right now. It's just way too crowded to do anything. I'm gonna try to make my way over to the dugout. It's pretty loud here right now. The helicopters are buzzing overhead. This place is coming alive. BP just ended. I finished with four baseballs total. That's okay. It's, it's below my average, but I feel like for an inaugural game at a stadium, that's decent. It was just so crowded in the left field. I was a little bit out of position, just a little bit confused really about where to go, but I like that confusion. Like I said before, it's fun to figure things out on the fly. Now during the game, I mean, my fantasy would be to catch the very first home run ever here, but short of that, just being near any ball and having a decent view for the game would be pretty sweet. Just hanging out here for a bit at the very top of the upper deck behind home plate, getting ready for the opening ceremonies. It was so crowded getting up here, we didn't even really stop. There were several bottleneck points in the concourses where between the walls, the railings, the beams, the concession stands, and the barricades, there was like 10 feet of space for everybody to pass through. So just catching our breath for a bit up here, really excited for the game to start soon. Please welcome Braves legend. selfie style for a moment here. My cameraman, Brandon, is in the upper deck. He's gonna take a picture of the very first pitch from up there. So I'm on my own down here just for the time being. There it is, first pitch, fly out to center field. We are underway here at SunTrust Park. It's the top of the third inning. Braves and Padres are tied two to two. And listen, when a new stadium opens, anything that happens is a first. Right now, we actually have the first instant replay review of the stadium. But there's the first pitch, which they take out of play. There's the first hit, the first walk, strikeout, error, run scored, RBI, extra base hit, and of course, the first home run. The ball from the first home run will be tremendously prized. And until someone goes yard, I feel like I need to be in the outfield trying to catch it. My odds out here in left field playing pretty deep are not great, especially with no room to run left and right, but one in a thousand odds are better than zero in a thousand. So until that happens, I'm staying put. Well, there's the first home run of this stadium. Ender Inciarte took six innings. I'm in left field, he hit it to right field. People say, how do you catch every ball? Well, I don't catch that one. That's a bummer, but it's still cool to be here to have witnessed it in person. A-T-L! 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 When that first home run was hit, I kind of lost the motivation to stay out in a crowded outfield, so I wandered into foul territory, got here just before the seventh inning ended. Padres left fielder Travis Jankowski caught the third out, 
and when he was jogging off the field, I wandered down to the front row, and check this out, he flipped the ball to me, and it's a commemorative opening day logo, so that feels really good, number five on the day. Okay, this is a first. This guy over here asked me to sign a plunger, but it's not just any plunger. Evidently, this can be used as a ball retrieving device, so maybe my signature on it will bring a little good luck. The big crazy first day here at SunTrust Park is over, and it went pretty well for me. I ended up getting six baseballs. Four of them were in batting practice. There was a toss-up in right center field. Then I scrambled for a home run and straight away near the chop house. Used the glove trick twice in the left field bullpen. And I got here just in time for the end of the seventh inning when Padres left fielder Travis Jankowski caught the third out and tossed me that ball right in the front row. So that was number five on the day. And then after the game, which the Braves won five to two, my buddy, a former ball hawk, who's now the bat boy, working the visiting team side named Evan, handed me a ball, so that was number six. So my lifetime total is now 9,520. I'm on pace to get number 10,000 this season, so stay tuned. I gave away two baseballs today, but all six count. And just really awesome to finally be at an inaugural game at a major league stadium for the first time. So again, stadium number 53 for me. I'm just feeling so good about this day and really looking forward to coming back here tomorrow.